Hello and welcome to Joe from the Cell Phone Geek. Today we are going to be setting up an Alexa Flex. So I'm going to go ahead, I did an unboxing video earlier, so if you're interested in that, you can go ahead and go back and take a look at that video. Let's get this out of the plastic. So this is the little box here that you can order online. So I'm going to go ahead and plug it in here into an outlet. going to do this initial start up here first time being plugged into power it's thinking about it hello your device is ready for setup just follow the instructions in your Alexa app, bringing your device online. Just a moment. All right, so that is up, blinking orange as it's supposed to. We're gonna come down here to the tablet. Maybe. Go into the Alexa app. Let's see how that'd be a little bit easier to see. So that's much clearer. You go down. Your Echo is ready. All right. Go down to devices and it looks like it connected automatically always if i go to my echo devices i've got a uh it's, at, at this point it's called uh joe's second echo flex because i did purchase two of these so if i go ahead and select it, it gives me the name so i can rename it volume which default set volume is at 70 percent tells me what wi-fi i'm connected to um it's currently set to built-in speaker uh, which is a speaker that's is a speaker that's built right into the bottom here. So I'll say, Alexa, what's the temperature outside? Right now, it's 41 degrees Fahrenheit. Tonight, expect a low of 27 degrees. Okay, so we're in the Chicago area, so that's our <laughs> current temperature right now. Um, the speaker on is decent. It's not great, but it's not terrible. Um, if it does music, I'm guessing, it's probably not going to sound much better than that. Um, if it's just talking like she is, it's not too bad. Um, but my, what I'm going to end up doing is I'm installing these in our bathrooms as our bathrooms have speakers already in the ceiling that I installed uh, a couple years ago. And I'm turning into now a smart speaker. So there's a headphone jack here on the side of this guy. So I'm just going to plug that in and then that will give me the ability to then send the sound through the speakers that are in the ceiling of the bathroom. So then uh, while we're uh, getting ready in the morning or uh, uh, for future kids doing bath time, we can play some fun music. And that'll give us the ability to do that with just this little guy. And uh, Amazon's got some great deals on these right now. So I purchased a couple of these, one for each bathroom. So we can uh, rock and roll. Oh, as I've thought about, uh, these are great even if you just want some quick information or to turn lights on and off in a specific room, if you got some other smart devices, some smart switches or lamps or something like that, or some smart bulbs, um, this would be an easy way to plug in and then use your voice to turn it on and off. So if you want to turn the light on and off by just walking uh, into the room without having to push the button on the wall because of, you know, got stuff in your hands or your hands are just dirty, you just use your voice and activate it so you can plug these in pretty much just any regular outlet can plug it in and easy to use um i've been waiting a while for amazon to come out with these and they're finally out and they has the uh the options on it that i've been looking for so it does have built-in bluetooth as well so you can bluetooth this little um flex here to a bluetooth speaker so that might be another option for you guys that are out there uh, if you have like a waterproof Bluetooth speaker that you use, uh, either taking a shower or just in the bathroom, um, this would be another option for that. So you can pair this to that and then you can have play music and then you don't have to worry about bringing your phone into the bathroom because um, phones uh, don't like humidity or getting wet. Uh, so this would be a way of getting around that. So you can plug this into an outlet in the bathroom or somewhere nearby and then have that Bluetooth speaker and go that way. Otherwise, like I said, there's the headphone jack on the side which is that uh, 3.5 millimeter socket. So you can plug in um, any sort of really speakers, even if you had some PC speakers, some old computer speakers, 
and you can set those up in the bathroom or wherever. Um, if you just want to be able to do kind of like a Sonos setup in uh, your rooms of your house, uh, this would be a, a cheaper and fairly simple way to go. Because you just buy a couple of these little guys here, they're about 20 or 25 bucks. Um, during Black Friday, they have reduced them down to about $10 a piece. So they're real cheap. And then if you got some speakers, um, you can plug them in and turn it into a smart speaker setup and with some decent sound and had set up some zones and you can play music everywhere. They're pretty sweet uh, little devices. They're really small. Um, I'd say it's probably about the size of a deck of cards really. And as you can see, when you plug into the socket, um, I have this other one here for protection for kids uh, usage, but so kids don't stick stuff in there. But as you can see, you can still use that top socket. It's not like it blocks the whole outlet where it's no longer usable. And also on the underside of this, there is a USB port um, that puts out five volts or 1.5 uh, milliamps. So you can uh, charge your phone if you want uh, through that port. Otherwise there is adapters you can get from Amazon. Uh, they got one that's like a night light that lights up as a, a low dim light. And then you can set a time of when you want that to come on. They have a motion sensor you can plug into there. They also have a clock that you can plug into there so you can have the time. So there is a lot of neat features um, built into this little guy. And this bottom button here, if you push that, that's going to mute the microphone. It does uh, stay red. It doesn't go away. So it does just stay on as red all the time. But now if you say Alexa, so she's not listening. So it mutes the microphone so she doesn't listen. Uh, the top button is so you can activate her to give her a command. So if you don't uh, want to say Alexa or uh, if you got muted like this, I believe you can still give her a command. What's the weather outside? Well, maybe not. I don't know. I'm just trying this out, see what it does and doesn't do. What's the weather outside? Now I guess you can't uh, talk to her with it muted. So when you hit that mute button, it actually does mute the microphone. So she's not listening at all. So if I unmute this, if I push this, what's the weather outside? In Poplar Grove, it's 41 degrees Fahrenheit with partly sunny skies. Today, you can look for mostly sunny weather with a high of 41 degrees and a low of 27 degrees. Okay, so if you don't want to say her name, you can push the uh, button there to activate her voice or to activate for listening. And then you can uh, give her the command from there. Otherwise you just use her name and uh, be a hey device. She'll uh, come up and you can talk to her and give her the what command you want and she'll go from there. But yeah, always uh, that was my quick setup. Uh, as you saw, it was super easy to configure. There's really not a whole lot. Um, if you've already got an Amazon account, uh, when you purchase it, it defaults to that links to your account. And then is, if you have the Alexa app on your phone and your Bluetooth is turned on, as you saw, I didn't even have to go in to the, you know, into the app and go in there and add the device. It added itself just by using the Bluetooth from my uh, tablet here and uh, shared the Wi-Fi password and the SSID, which is the Wi-Fi name and connected it right to the Wi-Fi. So it's already on the network and I mean, literally, you saw it, it was set up in less than two minutes, you know, less than five minutes, I'd say. It takes about 30 minutes to 45 seconds, 30 seconds to 45 seconds to uh, actually come up and be ready for the first initial use. And then from there, then it connected to the, to the network and then you're ready to use it. So yeah, so that's the new uh, Alexa Flex. And uh, so far, I'm really liking these. This is the second one I've purchased. Like I said, for Black Friday, they had a great deal on them, so I'm checking them out. But uh, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Always, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll put a link in the description below where you can get more info on these, as well as uh, it's our affiliate link. So that's how uh, we can keep our channel going and how we can keep purchasing more products. So I do ask that if you're interested in purchasing uh, one or a few of these, to please use my uh, link below, and that will keep bringing you some more comments content and uh, be able to help us out and help you out uh, figure out what you want to do for your house and maybe set up some smart devices in your home as well as I'm uh, starting to do here and trying to do it on a strict budget so I don't go uh, crazy and spend a lot of money but uh, again thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and we will catch you next time